Who wants to go first? For COC's philosophy department, it was time for discussion. The department hosted a screening of the film How to Blow Up a Pipeline, a film not without some controversy for its title and message. The film follows a group of environmental activists set on sabotaging an oil pipeline. And when the lights came back on, so did the discussion. Like a lot of the people that I associated with politically initially, um, they've also sort of given up hope. Students debated on whether or not activism actually impacts change. We kind of reconfigure things more than we actually make them better. Make them different, but we don't necessarily make them better. And the best way to approach it. Why are we focused on the, hey, what can you do for me? I'll do this for you. Tell me what you want, get it done, and I'll see what I can do. You, you, you can't just demand somebody like, do it, I guess. Or like you here to serve me. That the, the people people have their own agendas all the all the time. Despite the controversy in showing the film, the department says they wanted to create a space for students. Not to jump to conclusions and to to you know just push agendas and things, but rather a safe space to be able to think about what the noise that's going on around them. Students also shared their thoughts on the discussion and the film's message. A lot of the conversation we had was just discussing like the message and a lot of people were like disagreeing with the methods. I disagree with the methods, but I think what makes it compelling is, again, the why. For Canyons News, I'm Asia Haskin.